Each of us has the potential for extraordinary physical feats, but this potential only manifests itself in extremely extreme life or death situations. This phenomenon is called hysterical force. Hysterical strength is the manifestation by a person of extreme physical power that exceeds normal limits. It manifests itself when people find themselves in situations where every second matters and they have to make decisions on the edge of their capabilities. A widely known story is when a fragile woman, during an earthquake, held a concrete slab weighing 700 kilograms hanging over her child. But what other miracles is our body capable of? For many centuries, doctors, biologists, anthropologists and other professionals have been studying the human body and its hidden reserves. Sometimes simply incredible cases happen. People demonstrate the seemingly impossible. For example, an old woman lifts a truck hanging over her grandson, or a polar explorer jumps onto the wing of an airplane in seconds after seeing a bear. When it comes to life and death, the human body is capable of many things. It turns out that our brain uses only 5-7% to of its reserve, and the rest of the reserve is consumed in an extreme situation. An example of this is 22-year-old American Lauren Karnatsky from Virginia. In 2012, this fragile girl went into the garage to pick up her car and found her father no longer breathing inside. He lay unconscious under the car and was pinned under the body of the car, under which the jack had broken. The girl, running on pure adrenaline, lifted and moved a heavy BMW car to free her beloved dad. She, without thinking about her actions, began to perform artificial respiration on her father, and her loved one's heart began to beat almost immediately. Recalling what happened, Lauren said that the two-ton car at that moment seemed to her like just an oak table with short legs. I don't consider myself a hero, I saved my father. At the hospital it was discovered that his sternum, ribs, and spine were broken, but he remained alive and then got back to his feet, said Kornaki. Scientists believe that our spine in extreme conditions can withstand a load of 10 tons. But it's better not to check this. And this is not the only such case. In 1982, 30 years before Lauren Karnatsky, in Lawrenceville, Georgia, a young man named Tony Cavallo was crushed under a 1964 Chevrolet Impala that fell off its jacks. His mother, Mrs. Angela Cavallo, showed incredible strength and lifted the car high enough to save her son. And while working on a construction contract in Hawaii in 1988, Pilot and Vietnam veteran Steve Cooks lost control of his helicopter and fell into a drainage ditch. His colleague, Warren Everall, known as Tiny, lifted the 635 kilograms helicopter so another man could pull Cooks from the cockpit. In 2009, in Kansas, Nick Harris lifted a Mercury sedan to free a six-year-old girl who was trapped underneath it. His incredible strength allowed him to save the child and prevent the tragedy. In 2011, University of South Florida football player Danus Estenor lifted a 1,600-kilogram Cadillac Seville to save a man trapped underneath. Again in 2012 in Michigan, 15-year-old Austin Smith lifted a car to save his grandfather, who was trapped underneath it. His strength and determination helped him save a loved one. In Oregon in 2013, Teenage sisters Hannah and Haley lifted a tractor to rescue their father, who was trapped underneath it. Their combined efforts and incredible strength helped them save their father and showed that any challenge can be overcome if there is willpower. Also in 2013, a 72-year-old man named Cecil Stuckless of Salvage lifted a jeep to rescue his brother-in-law, who was trapped underneath it. His incredible strength and determination helped him save a loved one. In 2015, Nick Williams of St. John's lifted a four-wheel drive vehicle to rescue a little boy who was trapped under its tire. His strength and determination helped him save the life of a child and become a hero in the eyes of his community.